It's become our most popular feature on SSP TV News, our Volunteer of the Week, a person, couple, or group who makes this a better place to live. And it's brought to you by Workforce, Workforce Res Resources Staffing Company in West Hazleton. With temporary to permanent jobs and seasonal and temporary placements, you must apply in person. And now here's Lisa with tonight's honoree. Today, I am pleased to welcome Skylar Duffy to our studios. She is our Volunteer of the Week. This young lady is a senior at Hazleton Area High School, and when you hear what she's been doing with her time, you will know why she is the Volunteer of the Week. She was nominated by the Sugarloaf Township Fire Chief, Dwayne Hildebrand. Skylar, congratulations on this uh, recognition, and tell us about the many activities that you are involved with at the Sugarloaf Fire Company. Well, I am the junior fire chief at the Sugarloaf Fire Company, and I also do a little bit of running with EMS as well. And on the side of that, I also work two jobs, and I participate in three after-school activities, so I do juggle quite a bit. <laughs> Just a little bit, I would say. That's quite a handful. So how did you get involved uh, in the fire company as a junior volunteer? Well, originally my boyfriend introduced me to it, and once I got into it, honestly, I just developed such a passion for it. Like, I, don't, I honestly couldn't see myself doing anything else. So tell us about some of the roles that you have and some of the things you do with the Sugarloaf Township Fire Company. As a junior, we run drills, and we also help in the community, like doing breakfast to raise money for the company, or just running calls. If anybody needs anything, we'll run and get the tools for them and anything else they really need. And when you're helping with uh, the EMS, the ambulance service and that, you said you want to make a career, a medical career, you're looking to go into nursing. So this is giving you a much needed experience that you'll have for your career as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it just really coincides with what I want to do because you really have to get used to seeing some of the stuff that you do. It just, it's really helpful. You also came in because you said you wanted to encourage others to do the same. So mm -hmm. you're looking for junior volunteers to join. So tell us about that and who is eligible. Well, anybody, boy or girl, the age of 14 to 17, the Sugarloaf Fire Company is allowing juniors to come. And if they're interested, they can just give us a call and you can come to our drills and just see what it's like. And if you would like to apply, you could go to sugarloaftwp.org and under your fire department, you'll be able to find applications for that. What would you say to people? How rewarding has this been for you? Did you think you'd be as impressed as you are? Honestly, when I was a kid, like I never like I thought like being a firefighter is just a boy's thing. And now that I'm actually doing it, it's really such a rewarding thing. It gives you a sense of self accomplishment. And honestly, like not just that, but um, being uh, in the fire department, you gain friends, you gain family, and I don't know what I'd be uh, doing without the people there, not having them in my life today. They're like such good friends of mine, so. Does it make you more organized to do all this? Uh, that's a <laughs> little bit of a false statement. You really can't be organized with it. You just got to kind of try your best and just, you just kind of got to go and do it, <laughs> so. Well, we congratulate you for being our Volunteer of the Week. I think you're an inspiration to other young people out there. Hopefully, people will hear what you said, and maybe they would want to join as well, and maybe you'll get some new volunteers out of it. Yeah, it's honestly, trust me, like, if you do go decide to volunteer, you won't regret it, because it's honestly the best thing I could say I've ever done. So, Very well said. Skylar Duffy of Drums, a senior at Hazleton Area High School, and this week's Volunteer of the Week.